There are hundreds of programming languages out there. Freshers or Pudusa coding journey start on an anakiranga, experienced but upskill on an anakiranga, young Ella wrote a very question in the programming language category of Dindrata. This video is all about that, so let's begin. Hello, techies. Top 5 or best programming languages to learn in 2024. Now, in our coding journey, 5-7 programming languages I already learned. Currently, I programming languages learned. So, if you are new here, myself, Jennifer, I am working as a lead software engineer in a product-based company. So, in the video, the blueprint, first section, what are all the factors we need to know before picking a programming language? Second section, top 5 programming languages, in the factors related to one programming language or rating and under them, we will So, first section will follow. Factors to consider before learning a programming language. Number one, how big the job demand is. Every number of open positions is required for the programming language selection. Number two, average salary of the developer. So, in the given programming language, in terms of USD, every average salary is required for the program. Number three. Learning difficulty, how easy or moderate or difficult it is to learn. Number four, developer opinion. This is a particular job portal editor survey. How many percentage of developers still in the programming language consider pandranga or they love that programming language? Last but not least, future outlook or in the programming language, how many future la scope is there? From bottom to top, at number 5, C++. C++ is a low-level or machine programming language. This is coding a machine can understand it very easy so that we have many interpretations. As well, C++ is very efficient memory resources. So, if you have high efficiency performance related systems, you can use C++ as well. Use cases, game development, VR, robotics, embedded systems, critical performance systems, all of these things you can use C++ as well. Ratings, first factor, job demand. I would give 2 out of 5. You know, currently, there are 46k open job positions available for C++ developer. Number 2, average salary. Again, 2 out of 5. In USD dollar, la, average salary of a C++ developer is 120k USD dollars. Number 3, learning difficulty. I would give 3 because it is not that easy to learn C++. Number 4, developer opinion. I would say 1 out of 5. 47% you know, of developers na, they still love C++. Future score, I would give 3 out of 5. You know. In you know, embedded systems or high performance related systems like game development, this is C++ related. So it will stay for a while. At number 4, JavaScript. JavaScript is a beginner friendly and easy to understand programming language. JavaScript frameworks like Next.js, React.js, Native React.js, Vue.js, Express.js, this is a popularity reason. JavaScript there will be something new to learn. That's not true. If you learn the core level of JavaScript, which is Venla JavaScript, you can enter into any domain like back-end, front-end, or full-stack developer, which is one of the highest paying tech jobs. Use cases, web apps development, website development, game development, IoT, server-side apps, PWA apps, etc. Ratings, job demand, I would again give 2 out of 5. There are 41k open positions available for a JavaScript developer. Average salary, again 2 out of 5. JavaScript developer average salary is 106k USD dollars. And learning difficulty, it is very easy to learn, so I would give 1 out of 5. Developer opinion, 2 out of 5. 58 percentage of developers they still love javascript future scope i would say four out of five and javascript is the backbone of web development without javascript it is very difficult to design any app or design any backend at number three rest rust is the rising star in the world of programming language as well as it is rated number one programming language by the developers it's been used by a lot of big tech client softwares like Dropbox, Cloudflare, even by Microsoft, etc. Our channel is a number one Tamil programming channel to teach Rust. So if you want to learn Rust, check out this playlist. So Rust is not the language, it avoids common programming bugs in the earlier phase so that faster execution and high performance. So use cases would be Web3 development, Web development, performance critical systems, embedded system, game development and VR. Ratings, job demand. This is a job demand. So I would give only one out of five. There are only 22k open positions available right now. 
average salary 2 out of 5 average salary of a rust developer is currently 130k usd dollars learning difficulty 2 out of 5 it's kind of moderate to hard not like c++ developer opinion it is a number one programming language so i would give 4 out of 5 85 percentage of developers they love only rust future scope obviously 4 out of 5. It's been adopted in recent Web3 projects like Solana and all those things. So definitely it's going to last for a long run. At number 3, TypeScript. TypeScript is JavaScript with strong typing support. It supports modern JavaScript features like classes, modules, arrow functions, async weight. In the features alarm, this is maintainability and readability. Useful. Type system is used to read code read and easy as well as bugs are easy to find. Use cases, website development, server side scripting, PWA apps, IoT, desktop UI. So, we JavaScript to use JavaScript, but as a large scale application development. Ratings. Job demand, I would give 1 out of 5. And currently, 7k open job positions with the TypeScript developer. Average salary, it's 3 out of 5. And 130k USD dollars average salary of a TypeScript developer. And learning difficulty, again, 1 out of 5. It's easy to learn. Developer opinion, 3 out of 5. And 71 percentage of developers, they voted for this programming language. Feature scope, as same as JavaScript, 4 out of 5. Web development, TypeScript. As well, it is developed and maintained by Microsoft. So, it will definitely be there for a long time. At number 1, now my lot of favorite and without any doubt, it's a Python programming language. 30 as a market lark. Day by day, it is getting better and better. Even though the notable features in Pathina, easy to understand, low barrier to entry, easy to read, just like English programming language. Even though a lot of ready-made available packages, so one of the reasons. Plus, all kind of domains that you can use from the startup level to bigger tech clients like Microsoft, Google and all those companies are using this programming language. Famous domains like artificial intelligence, machine learning, data science, all of them are used in Use cases, machine learning, artificial intelligence, data visualization, data science, IoT, desktop GUI development, game development, microcontrollers, etc. Even in automation and business application development, Python and use Panna. Even our ratings, job demand, 4 out of 5. There are 84k open positions available for Python developer. Salary, I would give 2 out of 5. In a average salary of Python developer is currently 121k USD dollar. Learning difficulty, I would give 2 out of 5. It's like easy to moderate. Developer opinion, 2 out of 5. 65 percentage of developers, they had voted for Python. Feature scope, I would say 4 out of 5. It's been used across all domains. So there is a scope that it will there for a long time. So it's time for my choice. If you ask me, in the two programming language, choose to learn and learn start, I would say Python, JavaScript or Rust. And I don't scope and I don't features. It will be there for a long time. So if you are somebody who is preparing for your tech interviews and you don't know how to prepare or you're getting rejected a lot, not to worry. We have developed a number one AI based interview coach very recently. It's in release phase. I'd ask you to sign up using this link to join the waiting list and get early free benefits. So I would see you soon. Take care. Bye-bye.